Good morning, everybody. Here's Pete with Furious. Where we're going, Furious? Hey, Furious. No, he doesn't want to tell anyone. Tell everyone where we're going. No. We're going to uh, get some surgery down on his leg. Um, today's the day. I go over there. It's now 7.30 in the morning. Pretty much leave him there for the entire day and I pick him up the next day. We call him throughout the day to find out what exactly is going on, how the surgery went and all that. But, um, yeah. Right now we're heading there. I'll keep you guys updated throughout everything that goes on. Um, because that's what I do. It's a rainy day though. That kind of sucks. It sucks for a lot of things. It makes you sleepy and just not as excited about everything, right? So, what are you looking for over there, Furious? He just wants to hang out. He knows what's up. This guy's more than excited to go here. Good old pet bed here. And here, come on. Hey, Furious, sit. You out of here? Can I sit? You out of here? You ready to go? Surgery? Yeah? All right. He's in good hands, right? That's right. Yeah. All right, cool. <laughs> See you, Furious. Yeah, so we call you as soon as everything is done. I would yep. say probably around 2 p.m., eh? Cool. If not, you can give us a call anytime, eh? Sounds you good. Know, you know the routine. All right, so just got word from the doctor. Uh, I won't be able to see Furious today, but his surgery went well. Uh, no complications. Uh, really happy to hear. Can pick him up tomorrow morning. Uh, obviously, he needs to be overnight in the hospital just to make sure that um, that everything is okay. That you know, just monitor him. Obviously, sleepy is he had uh, anesthesia and, and all that, right? So, uh, good news. Uh, I'll get to see him tomorrow. So he'll be wearing a cone like he did last time, so he doesn't bite his uh, staples. But um, he uh, he's gonna be good now. So, heading to the vet now. Uh, time to pick up Furious. See how he's doing. Uh, got called. Apparently he's doing pretty good. Um, he is gonna be a cone head for a little while until those staples get removed. So he's not gonna be happy about that. That's for sure. Um, so yeah, time to do that, pick him up. And then uh, I guess, uh, so I ended up getting too much money for for all of this. And uh, I just, I'm, I feel stupid. Um, I, I wouldn't keep it. This is not, it's not me. I, uh, I, I was more than grateful for, for getting funds for this surgery because uh, it was, you know, it, I was in a tough place when it happened. Uh, when uh, when everything came together um, and you know I, at the end of the day I think I would have been relieved if I got comments from you guys and just support which I always do regardless so uh, this was just above and beyond um, you know there's I'm, honestly there's part of me that just feels guilty for accepting donations and probably people are gonna be like oh fraud scam all this but anyways uh so with the leftover uh money we're gonna keep about uh about a thousand bucks for his uh post recovery uh he's got a couple other things that happen and just any other unforeseen expenses and then the rest uh which is gonna be about three grand because gofundme takes 10 percent uh we're gonna donate to uh i believe the canadian uh humane society uh because we donated for a pet cause i figured uh just donating the rest of the money to another pet cause would be uh would be the way to go so we're gonna go ahead and do that later this week uh once the funds not all the funds have been transferred to uh transferred yet so but when that happens that's what we're gonna do if you have a better suggestion for um for the rest of the money uh where it should go please let me know in the comments box below well but anyways let's go uh let's go pick up furious and see how he's doing it's a masterpiece, he said to something else. It's a masterpiece. Yeah. <laughs> you see? Wow. Yeah. So, it's crazy. Yeah. So, you see what's done? I always look so robotic. <laughs> Looks good, though. Cool. You see osteotomy? It means cutting the bone. Yeah. Readjust the angle and put the plate. Okay? So, it's TTA procedure. So, actually, now, right now, the joint is stable. 
Mm -hmm. you, know, you know, so cruciate ligaments are not necessary anymore because it's all the dynamics of the joints Very completely cool. actually. No, so it's quite a complicated, you know, but this is gold standard. Yeah. Gold standard and the guy is probably the best in North, uh, North, uh, here in Toro Greater Toronto area because everybody using him. It's amazing when I he can hear putting, him. putting his way down completely already. After really? Surgery. Yeah. Curious. Look at that, buddy. Hey, Mr. Conehead. There he is. There he is. Hey, hey, hey. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I know. I know. As you can see, actually, no, stop losing, guys. So it should be oh, fine. Yeah. Oh, good. There it is. All right, we'll look at this later. All right, everything paid for. It took a little while. Had some issues. Uh, Furious, in your cone. Hey, hey, how you doing? Not too happy, um, but everything was done well. Said that there's a little bit of oozing, uh, but it's just normal. So uh, a lot of post therapy now. Keep you guys informed. But Furious is doing okay. He hates his cone. He hates his cone. He absolutely hates his cone. I'm gonna give him some air, but it's not really gonna help him because he won't be able to get there with his cone. <laughs> oh, you poor thing. Okay, I'm gonna go home so he can move around. So we're back. Furious just doesn't like this cone at all. He remembers how terrible it was before. And now he's just... Oh, I feel terrible. But this is good. <laughs> Way to move the entire box, Furious. Are you stuck? Do you not know what to do right now? Or is he thinking that this is a good idea? Hey! Hey! There you go. Say hi. Here, let's get you some water. Oh, I'm gonna get you some water. Take that out in a second. This is his leg. I'll show you some details later, but close your eyes if you don't like to see graphicness. Ew. But, uh, that's him. He's not gonna like this cone for a while. He's gonna be hitting me with it. But thank you very much, everybody. He is home now. Gonna give him some water. Catch you guys later. Stay sexy. Stay hungry. And of course, get laid, my friends. Alright, just finished workout with this man, Steve Cook. We finally got, yeah, we killed it. Chest and tries. Can't even, oh, I can barely bounce him now. Think, yeah. There we go. That means I didn't work him out hard enough. Uh, great workout. 